So in this video, you are going to learn how you can basically set up the Firebase in Unreal Engine 4. So first of all, you need to download the Firebase feature plugin. Once you download, you need to open Unreal Engine. Let's create a third person template. Let's set it to desktop and set it to start content and let's set it to Firebase project. Once you do that, then click on create project. At this meantime, you can go in Firebase console account, click on add a project. Now you need to, you can give the same name. Once you do that, you need to click on continue, then continue again, then set it a uh, default account for Firebase, click on create app. At this meantime, as you can see, the new plugins are available. Click on manage plugins and at here search that Firebase. And you find the Firebase feature plugins. Click on enable. Click on restart now. Okay, so now the Firebase plugins are start working. Okay. So, okay, so our Firebase is now ready to run. So, what you need to do? We need to first of all create a service folder in our Unreal Engine folder. So let's go where, where you saved your Unreal Engine, uh, your all the files and other things. So head here, that is my Unreal Engine Firebase project. And here you need to create a folder called service. Service. Once you add the service uh, folder, then click on continue. And at here, now you, you need to click on android now you can set up your com dot package game data so make sure you never change your pack package name data for android because it's very uh, because if you change the package name data it will in future you find problem so let's give it dot fire base project okay so com dot firebase project i'm just saving this one once you save this thing come at here Paste the same thing then click on register the app once the register will be done you need to click on download config then add a you can skip this stuff you don't need to do this thing click on continue with console then go to authentication and then click on get a start and now let's enable the email and pass click on saved once you do that you can go to real-time database then click on create now set it to us name central you can set anything else also for now i will be set in test mode also there's a lock mode available lock mode the firebase real time variables will be not work so just for now let's use the test mode click on enable but make sure that is now a 30 days limitation rules so it means that after then the 30 days the real time database become expired so you need to basically reset up your uh, real-time database you need to just change the rules the data then go to storage then click on create the storage next and name 5 us central click on create so now it's creating storage so because what storage and five is the storage is a very good option because at the storage we can save our files image or any kind of like files that's why <coughs> also now we need to download the dot json file okay and we need to paste it in our folder like this folder okay so just copy now you need to put you can go to project project settings and now click on download google service once you do that as you can see it's coming at here now what you need to do come in your download just click on cut go to where you save your unreal engine uh, your game or project then go to service and paste this file now you need to basically restart this thing okay so simply just close this thing and reopen so now what will be do it will be activating your firebase components so because the vision file can be now picked so that's why once you open the firebase project so now we can basically use that for example, I'll be show you that are the Firebase is working or not. So let's go to authentication and let's create a uh, user with using Unreal Engine. Let's go to open level class. 
then at open level class let's call begin play and with begin play let's click on au th author and now we'll be create a author so like a user so at author section we found create a user with email and pass so now we can provide the email so let's give it sajjad at gmail dot com let's add a password one two three four five six seven eight nine then if the it's created so let's print string that done okay now compile and save now let's click on play so as you can see it's telling that done now let's check in our firebase so as you can see correctly it's now empty so if we click on reload so as you can see this adjust then is come at firebase it's mean that our firebase is now fully connected with our unreal engine so in future we'll be here i'll learn something more so thank you so much for watching guys love you all bye bye see you in the next video